storm show. Hey, it's a storm show. We need to talk about Lil Durk in India, aka wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, aka all I need in this life for sin is me and my girlfriend. They was on a Bonnie and Clyde shit, so they were actually in their house and uh, at, uh, at five fourteen a.m. on a Sunday. A bunch of dudes actually broke into their, I'm assuming, man, broke into their house. They exchanged fire, all right? They live out here in Atlanta, in the suburbs, of course. And at 5.14 a.m. on a Sunday, for intruders to come in your house with the goal of of killing y'all, pretty much, all right? Because they wasn't in there to play patty cake. That should let you guys know that you guys were what? You were set up. Not only were you set up, they knew you would what? You would be home. They were assuming you would be asleep. And it actually low-key sounds like some assassination type shit. Because guess what? If you go out on a Saturday, you stay out late, you sleeping in on a Sunday, they can they expected to catch you guys off guard, period. But they didn't. And Dirk had his guns, and India had her guns, and they exchanged a shootout, and they came out this shit okay. But at this point, though, uh, the, the suspects are remaining unnamed. But this is what you guys got to understand. This shit didn't happen by circumstance. Somebody in your camp is a motherfucking snake. And this is what y'all need to figure out. And so if I was India or if I was Dirk, I would clear out everybody, all my friends, all my associates, all my staff, people that come to the house. Everybody needs to go. You probably need to move. You need to keep your schedule on the low for a while because people is out here and they on your head. Now, we already know that little Dirk was lifelong best friends with King Von. Who ended up getting killed outside of a uh, outside of an Atlanta club, and so some people are wondering: Is this some street stuff that's lingering over? All right, did somebody just put a straight hit out on Lil Dirk? I have a theory. I have a theory, and I want y'all to I want I want y'all to go down this road with me, right? Why are all these young rappers either getting killed, having assassination attempts on them? Uh, 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 cars being shot up. Like, why is this always happening, right? If y'all don't put two and two together and don't understand that this has to be coming from the record labels, I don't know what to tell you. The record labels and entertainment business is backed up by the mob, mafia, and street gang culture. And so, think about this as, as like a business plan, right? You sign an artist, you put them in that 365 or that them bullshit deals where you own everything, including their name forever, right? They put out some music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They make some money. Then you off them. You already have a built-in life insurance policy in their contracts. Hey, Diddy. So then there's a payout of millions to the music, to, to the record labels. As soon as, damn, my damn braces just clicked. As, as soon as the rapper dies. Not to mention, the sales of the music are going to increase. Not to mention, they're just going to keep re-releasing music because somehow Pop Smoke is still putting out shit. And I'm still trying to figure out how that works and why that's okay. And then the record labels can just make money forever and ever. And then these rappers get sacrificed. And then they move on to the next because we are in a sacrificing season, whether y'all realize it or not. Do y'all think I'm crazy? I, I just I just want to see how y'all feel about that. Do y'all think I'm crazy? A as I wear my Scarface shirt. It's too much stuff happening to these rappers and the young rappers, too, and the young street rappers. They they need to move, right? Insurance, that's all. They did it with Tupac. Talk about it. Y'all feeling where I'm going? I can't necessarily prove that, but it just makes the most sense. And happy birthday to Ash, by the way. All right. I'm going to leave that at that. I'm going to say Indian Dirk, if y'all smart, y'all will move. Y'all will start moving in silence. Because people is on y'all heads, baby. They on y'all heads, whether you realize it or not. Uh, it's storm show. Ay, it's storm show.